I confess, I'll never be the showman my opponent is, and that's okay with me. Just look at, look at the show he put on with Dr. Oz today. But I am going to deliver for you and your family just like I did for Sarah all those years ago with the Children's Health Insurance Program that gave her the chance to be the extraordinary young woman she is. And I'll tell you something else. People accuse me of all kinds of things. You probably have seen that. But nobody ever accuses me of quitting. And I will never give up. I'll never walk away, no matter how tough the going gets. I'm actually asking Americans to hold me accountable for my ideas and hold my opponent accountable for his. We're offering ideas, not insults, uh, plans that will make a real difference in people's lives, not prejudice and paranoia. And as you know, my opponent is running a very different kind of campaign. His latest target is a pastor in Flint, Michigan, who respectfully asked him not to use her pulpit for political attacks. He called her a nervous mess. That's not only insulting, it's dead wrong. Reverend Faith Green Timmons is not a nervous mess. She's a rock for her community in trying times. She deserves better than that. And Flint deserves better. In fact, so does America. My, my senior staff uh, knew, and uh, information uh, was provided to a number of people. And look, this was an ailment that many people just power through, and that's what I thought I would do as well. Uh, I didn't want to stop. I didn't want to you know, quit campaigning. I certainly didn't want to miss uh, the 9-11 memorial as a uh, senator at that time, I consider it a sacred moment, and I was determined to get there. It didn't work out, so uh, I uh, got the antibiotics uh, up and going, got the rest that I needed, and uh, we're going on from there.